James Gunn's tenure as co-CEO of DC Studios has changed the scenario of the DC landscape itself. Gunn's reign is a nod to the end of Zack Snyder's Snyderverse and his crew of superheroes on the front lines as he envisions a different DC universe. Welcome to Stats In. If you're just joining us please subscribe and don't forget to turn on notifications bell for more videos. Gunn's decision to replace the main superheroes is a bold and surprising move indeed, but it was done anyway. However, there are criticisms of the renovation as well. Many fans and industry experts are criticizing Gunn's move given the recent box office history of DC's roster. The huge transition from the Snyderverse to the Gunnverse is a surprise as James Gunn announced the revamp of DC following his takeover by DC as co-president of the studio. Gunn has already rolled out his plans for DC rosters and new actors which became clear after he replaced Henry Cavill as Superman aka Kal-El or Clark Kent with David Corinsweet. Gunn also cast some other actors in his new Superman movie, Superman, Legacy, noting that all of the new actors will appear across the DC universe. However, Charles Roven, Gunn's close friend and Snyderverse producer, has concerns about Gunn's decision. Speaking with The Hollywood Reporter, the producer revealed his concerns that a big change might be a bit jarring, as DC has already established its headquarters with Zack Snyder. Right now, they're actually rebooting everything, and it's a little unclear to me how limited they want to use or not use any DCU actors in the same roles. So I'm not really sure, but right now, we're not having any discussions really, James and I are good friends. My wife and I are good friends with him and his wife, Jane, Holland, so we see each other socially, but we don't really talk about any work. Of course, Gunn isn't changing all the previous characters but the major change in DC frontman and the uncertain fate of some other characters has already put an exclamation mark. Fans will have to wait until Gunn's original rosters are released to see the success of his tenure. According to reports, Gunn is currently working on a series of films that includes his own films, Superman, Legacy, and other A-listers like The Authority, The Brave and the Bold, Supergirl, Woman of Tomorrow, Swamp Thing and two Elseworld films. Joker 2 and Batman Part 2 Wonder Woman star Gal Gadot recently teased Wonder Woman 3 developments with DC co-presidents Peter Safran and Gunn promising her a return to the franchise after co-stars Cavill and Ben Affleck had to leave the studio. Okay that's it for this episode. 